hi guys thank you for coming back to my channel this is your girl bamji foods diy today i'll be teaching you guys how to make this transparent dishwash liquid soap you see how it is very clear and transparent any color you add to it even though it will still be very 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 transparent this kind of dishwash you can make it and package it as souvenirs and supply to ceremonies and make your money we just three ingredients we'll be making four to five liters of this particular liquid soap in this video with just three ingredients so please guys stay 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 back continue and watch please don't forget to like and share and subscribe to my channel as you watch thank you guys a lot to my channel so this is the first ingredient we are going to be using salt we're going to be using 175 gram of salt you saw the salt i i i, I sampled before it's the normal kitchen salt so must not be industrial salt salt is salt sodium chloride please this is our sls we are going to be using sls in 75 grams and the third thing we are going to use is the texapone our texapone gel please buy the texapone gel tell them when you get to the chemical store that you want texapone gel for 250 grams i think it sold for 500 naira that's the third ingredient if you want to add perfume you are free if you want to add any color you are free but these are the only three ingredients you need let's dive straight into it first i added three liters of water to a bowl i want to make four to five liters so i started with three liters I hope you understand. This is the normal process you will make our liquid soap so that at the end your soap will not be very watery. So I started with 3 liters first. I added my texapone to it, scooped in all the texapone into it and then started stirring. You have to stir for some time so that the texapone can actually mix very very well. For this texapone to completely dissolve in this water. I have to be truthful you have to stir for at least 15 minutes 10 to 15 minutes for it to properly dissolve and please you can just use a wooden spatula when you are doing yours you must not use a whisk because i noticed that this whisk normally brings out foams when i'm doing my liquid soap it brings out instant foaming from the mixture so just use a wooden spatula i think it will be best for you to do that the next thing we'll be adding is our sls so i'm adding it as i'm still stirring continue adding and stir remember i said you can use a wooden spatula if it's what you have or any wood you use for your production in the house or a a silicone spatula is okay anyone can serve so you continue mixing continue mixing very well The next thing on our list after our SLS is to bring our salt in. Now watch and see what will happen as we are adding the salt. On adding your salt to this already existing tooth mixture, you will notice that this um, solution will start getting very thick. But don't worry, continue adding. This is actually what you need for your liquid soap to become very thick. But it will be very, 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 very thick. So add all your salt and be turning. You can see as I'm turning, as I'm turning, it will be getting very thick. Watch and see. Look at how thick it has become. Very, very thick. As in, I can't even move my hands very well again with the whisker. When it has gotten to this stage, you actually feel it to determine whether you are okay with this texture. 
If you are not okay with this texture, you can go ahead and add the remaining 1 to 2 liters of water. For me, I added only 1 liter to make it 4 liters and I think I'm okay with the texture at 4 liters. I stopped there. At this point, you may decide to add your fragrance if you wish. And also, if you can also add your color at this particular point if you wish. Some people actually call and request for only transparent soap. They don't want any color in it. So if, if you have those kind of customers, this is good for you. And if you have people that also call you for to make souvenir dishwash for them, for maybe a wedding ceremony, a birthday, or a burial, this is also a good procedure you can use and deliver and save costs. At this point, I added the extra one liter. Then I left everything to settle for some hours. Look at how clear the liquid soap looks like. Very transparent. You can see through it. I added, I divided the batch into two and added lemon color to some and then left the rest as transparent to suit my customers the ones that want transparent will get their own and the ones that want the colored one will get theirs and it's very foaming thank you for watching bye